Okay. So these are the ingredients. We're we're gonna start actually over here with the with the yeast. Oh, by the way, we're gonna make some bread. We're gonna make olive garlic bread. Mm -hmm. And I haven't made bread in a long time, so please be forgiving. <laughs> this is my neighbor and my friend, too. She's going to teach is, me how. This is yeast. We have yeast, and we have molasses, salt, brown sugar. This is hemp seeds, and there was something I put on the bottom of the, I can't, oh, yeah, um, wheat germ. Oats, garlic, cornmeal, applesauce, and olives. Applesauce. And, and olives. olives. So, and this is the flour. And that's the flour. So what was the name of the bread again? Well, that our, um, olive garlic bread is what we're making. I started with just a, a wheat bread recipe, but I kind of modified it. <coughs> so we are starting, we're going to start with four cups of water, warm water. Looks like it's too hot. I'm not going to show okay. who's teaching me because she asked me not to. She's not one of those persons that wants to be showing on videos or whatever so but I will show myself this is me <laughs> <laughs> and we are happy to be here today yes I'm, I'm, a, I'm the student yes we are all very happy so we're going to start here we're going to throw in the yeast because this is where it all starts with the yeast and Mary, how much water you put there? This, I'm starting with four cups of water, and we're just gonna cook this yeast up. With. I'm not cooking it; I'm just mixing it. Yeah, it's just on the top of the yeah. stove. Yeah. Uh, and it's frothing it. nicely. This is really truly a homemade, a homemade recipe. bread recipe. Bread recipe. Now, I have not made bread for probably 20 years, so we're hoping this comes out good. <laughs> if it's not, we're still going to eat it. That's right. We're still going to eat it. I think it's going to be good. We're going to do... all this good We're just going to put in two tablespoons of molasses, which yeah. is she about that. Even, she don't even measure it. She just by eye. No, we just put it in there. Put it know. there. It's not going to hurt. That's how I, I do my recipes, too. What? But I Kind of I mean, for anything, I, I, I never make any bread yet, but yeah, I mean, you can some. feel it, you know, you can feel well, it. Well, the only bread I make is uh, for breakfast bread. Uh. <laughs> biscuits. Oh, biscuits. Yeah. Yeah, I love making biscuits. Yeah. So that I like one. making cheesecakes, too. I made cheesecakes yesterday. We'll show you them when the bread is rising. So when we're when we're done making this, uh, how many bread, how many loaf of bread you can make in this? This should make five loaves. Oh my, that's a make, lot. Yeah, five loaves. Well, you're gonna take some home. Oh, right? I'm sure. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure. This is what I'm doing for Easter for my friends. Yesterday I passed out the cheesecake, and today we're gonna make bread, and I'm gonna give a loaf to Miriam and a loaf to Sandy and Bobby. This is salt. I'm adding the salt. I'm not really big on salt, but it's okay. I'll probably need some salt too. You just have to really grind in there. You can hear that. And now this is brown sugar. Brown sugar. Mm -hmm. Brown sugar. Uh, is that measured by a cup? Pardon? Is that a cup of sugar? Uh, it's a half a cup. Most of this is half a cup. Um, well, I start with half a cup. I set my bread. Hey, it don't look like it. <laughs> <laughs> I put my flour. At oh, I don't really a, care. A, this is a cup of gluten flour, and this is four cups of flour, but I may not use it all depending upon how it feels. Mm -hmm. Because I have a lot of ingredients to go in here. This is applesauce. I can get the applesauce out of there. Come on. Come on out of there. Supposed to be a half a cup of applesauce. Yeah, it is. Half a cup of applesauce. <laughs> well, alright, let's cry a knife. I'm gonna make myself, I'm short. I'm gonna make myself more shorter so you can see it because she don't want to be showing her face in this video. Or, or, uh, Which is fine with me as I, long as I'm she kind of fat. <laughs> 
Well, that's what happens when you're a grandma and you love to cook. You need a yes. good man to cook for. If there are any good men anymore. Oh, they're so plenty. That. Okay, so now we're adding. Only God is a very good man. Yeah. We're adding hemp seed and wheat germ. Half a cup each. Half a cup each. Do you want to stir, Miriam? Yeah. Where's me? I'm gonna see it. Yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm stirring it. And we need a half a cup of oil. Can we get the oil in there? Half a cup of oil. What kind of oil are you using? I'm just using canola oil. It's in a vegetable oil thing, but I, I, it's a really oh, canola you. oil. Well, go ahead. I'll just hang this here for a minute. Okay. She's using canola oil. But you can use any oil except what? Nothing. Well, any you oil. can probably use any oil. I, I haven't tried other oils, but I was thinking sesame, but I thought maybe it would be too, too much. Not too much, yes. Maybe That's too, too much. much. So here's a half a cup of oats and a half a cup of cornmeal. That cornmeal is uh, organic cornmeal. It's from uh, Riverview Farms in Morristown. She used so much of organic like me too. Yes, very organic. I've used all and this organic, organic stuff. Yeah. It's good for you. Mm -hmm. Well, everybody knows that, right? Everybody knows that. It's more that. expensive, but it's worth doing it for your own good. You eat organic, you don't get coronavirus. <laughs> yes, because you have this all is, that. This is the garlic, and the garlic was in oil. I don't think that, you know, you don't have to be spot on with this. It's very forgiving recipe. Yes. Don't need to I be. say that now, but we'll see you don't if it'll have arrive. To be Perfect, that's what she's saying. And now we are putting in the olives. Say the olives. Yeah. The olives. And there Ooh, are just a few left. My hands are clean. Yeah, she cleaned her hands. 20 seconds. <laughs> yeah. 20 seconds. And now right. we're going to put our... We're going to put our gluten flour in now. Go ahead and stir oh, it. This yeah, really she used the gluten free because she... She is well, this gives your bread a lot of elasticity. It's very good for this. You use it to digest. Yeah. Get yeah, that stirred really well because that stuff really well, needs to be stirred up. I can smell up. it very, very good. Oh, yeah. It's, it smells great. I like yeah. making a rye bread, too. If I had somebody who would buy bread, I would, I would cook more often. Yeah. Now we're adding a little flour. Yeah, if you want to buy, Keep. we'll make it for you. Yeah. Keep stirring. That's what we need to do with that house you bought next door, Miriam. We need to get the kitchen up the code and then make cook, make a company. Missy and Miriam's messes. Oops, sorry. Yeah, we're going to do that. We're going to okay. be cooking all kinds of stuff. And it gets it gets harder to, to stir. When it gets too hard, we'll use our hands, or I'll use my hands. Yeah, she's using the kneading process very exciting. That's the one I'm not yeah. very fond of kneading, but this is four cups of flour, pastry flour. I use pastry flour, folks. It just is so nice and light and oh I'd love to feel the it's very good. So what brown is that? Oh no, we're not gonna say it, brown because we're not gonna you tell me later because we're not gonna commercialize this. Yeah, we're not gonna They're gonna pay me. <laughs> <laughs> this is home video. Okay. Okay. Now it's probably getting a little bit too sticky. So we're gonna use the uh, harder yeah. harder one. We're going to use where is my spoon? Right now we should use this spoon. A little more. You need that wooden spoon. Yeah, well, I got one somewhere. I just wasn't prepared for it. Hold on. If you can tell, I'm also a cook. See how I eat? Yeah. <laughs> but I we never do mass make... cooking. We cook together. It would be really good. Cool. I can cook yeah. anything. I will make everything homemade also. I will be... We love to cook. We love to cook. Yes. We are the girls who love to cook. Yes. Okay. Looks like you can't knead this. It's still too. It is very. Wet. It's very. It's very good. 
smells so good. I know, it's going to be great if it raises. <laughs> it will. It so how long you have to leave it? Well, we ra we'll raise it until it's doubled in size. Uh, it's not quite at the consistency I need yet, so we add a little oh, yeah. bit more more flour. You don't want to add too much. No, okay. Time. You don't want to add too much flour. Who's making all the noise? Where did my phone go? Oh, here it is. Can you look if you can see me there? Yeah. Because I'm short. She's so <laughs> I'm not as small and cute as Miriam is, so oh, she used to we be. have to. But that's we okay. Have to just do what okay. we can do. But she's still healthy, and you don't even know how old she is. But <laughs> she is way better on her age. Yeah. Okay, so this is getting pretty thick, and we're just. Trying to develop that gluten by mixing. Boy, that is smelling good. That's maybe too strong, huh? You think I put too much garlic in? That's okay. I like it anyway. Well, when you cook those, it's not going to be, yeah, it's, it's gonna be not going to be too. Hmm? When it's already cooked, it's not going to be too that smell anyway. Yeah. It changes. Well, hopefully it'll raise up and make a lot of loaves of bread. I didn't even get my bread pans. I don't want to add too much flour. I'm going to put too much fluid in here. But of course, later we're going to use our hand. That's how we make it really <coughs> taste good, huh? Yeah. <laughs> that will really develop the flour, you know. Yeah. Develop this. You want to wash my hands? Yeah, wash your hands. My hands are already clean. I'm going to let you put, you're going to have to give me more uh, flour. Okay, I'll, I'll be the one to do that, so you're not going to. Oh yeah, this is going to take more flour. I'm going to change my ways. I'm going to end up on the floor. Do you want me to get down there so you can... Yeah. Okay. Because that's... You can get more... It'll end up being smart. down here. Okay. You have to give me some floor. I got some flour on your leg. That's okay. Throw it in there. We're adding more. A little more. Keep going. It may take more flour than that, so... What kind while, of while flour I'm doing are you this, using now? Yeah. Uh, it'll probably take more than that. Go ahead and throw some more in there. This is... Oh, this is nice. Hold on, let me... This is going to be nice when it's, when it's done. Yeah, we need more flour. So, just go ahead and get that flour. This one? Yeah. One more in there. That's good. That's good. Okay. Okay. Hopefully we'll get to kneading. This is what we're starting to do is knead the bread. It's starting now. A little bit. Yeah. More flour. No, I want oh, it to go around. you want it to roll. That's yeah. why. Uh, we need more flour. It's still too sticky to, to grab. Just dump it in there. Okay. Oh, this is nice. We're going to probably need more. Look in that cupboard up there, Miriam. See if uh, I have more flour up in the cupboard before. Because I have some in the refrigerator, but I didn't well, think it? I would need it. Yeah. That one, yeah. Open that one. Uh, okay, open the next one. This one? Yeah, is there flour oh, up there? Oh, sugar. Uh, okay, so look on the counter. Look on that counter behind the jars. Just look. That's gluten free. Nah, that's not the one I want. They're all gluten free. Uh. That's gluten free. Okay, in the in the refrigerator here, there is a package of flour. Uh, in the back, on um, yeah, on the left side there, in the back is a red bag. Stuck in the back on the second shelf there, it's way in the back. You have to take things out. So we are still under process looking for flour. Yeah, I did I didn't think enough flour out. But that's okay. We're gonna get the flour. It's the way like this when you cook. Yeah. <clears throat> okay. And then just here we go again. Yeah. Yeah. 
a rod in there. Okay, that's good. Let's try that. Oh, yeah, this is starting to feel good. See, people oh, asking yeah. why bread sometimes is homemade or expensive because look how hard it is. We don't have the machine. Yeah, you can do it. machine, and yeah, machine tastes good, but homemade is made with love. This is made with love in it. Love for my friends, love for my family. Yes. If I need more flour. If they were close enough, I would put bread on their doorstep to say Merry or Happy Christ Easter. Easter. I got Christmas on the brain. Yeah. And this is what she do when her kids are growing up. I and mean, look at her children. She got doctor children. Yeah. I need daughter, more. We need more. A nurse practitioner. Oh, yeah. But she's so patient. And, That's good. You know. Patient things showing up to your. You do it God's also. way. You take care of your family. You do it God's way, then you you have happiness. Yes. And even if the world tries to take your happiness away, we have the promise of heaven. Yes. So. The one in here, it's not forever. That's right. Really, so you don't need to worry about it. Okay. Just like making like this, don't make if you're not happy because it's just. Not be good. It's not gonna be good. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Anything. More, got more flour. Boy. Everything you have to okay. do. Let's do that. Make it fun. Right Especially ahead. it's good for you. Because it's important. Make things important in your life, especially for your health. Boy, I can't believe how much flour I'm using. I only use four cups because of water. Well because it's five. Yeah, five probably. Bread. That's a lot. Okay. That's the last of it? More? Yeah, more. Put, put more in there. Okay. The good thing that. is you have a help. Yeah, thank goodness, because I'd have been in a mess getting that out of the refrigerator. Yeah, I can tell <laughs> how messy it is. We're almost there. A little more flour. We need just pour it on there, baby. Pour it on there. Pour it, baby. Okay. And you know, she is really good at making a lot of things too. And so am I. I'm gonna buy some. Oh, yeah, you too. cook. <laughs> we need to video you. <laughs> We're gonna make some of mine make too, and she's the one gonna kitchen. video you too. Yes. This is a heavy, it's heavy, I can feel it. Oh boy. It's gonna yep. be great. It's gonna be good bread. Yeah, a little more. Feels. Hopefully that's good. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Yes, much easier with Miriam here to help me with this. Oh, this looks great. It's starting to come. See, it's still too sticky yet. Get down there. <laughs> It's stuck to my hands. And pretty soon, because right now it's the springtime, pretty soon we have our garden going and we're going to cook our oh, stuff yeah. from the garden. Yep. Because we garden too. We love gardening and then we have so much wild stuff on the back, like those berries. We pick mm -hmm. those and make jams. Oh, and yeah. All, all the good stuff. I'm trying we're to very, unstick my fingers here. Well, we're pretty much mostly self-sufficient. We try to be. We no, try we, to be. We try to be self-sufficient. It's nice to be like that because a little, little hard bit times more. come. A little bit more. When hard times comes, then you can easily survive. You know, if you can survive this life That's right good. now. That's good. Let's try that. All right. This is really getting. This is feeling good. really good. <laughs> I feel real blessed today. I feel the Lord's really going to give me some good bread to eat. <laughs> God is good. Uh-huh. As long as you offer everything unto Him. Yeah, everything. For His yeah, glory. Bread right off of here. This is feeling good. It's going to be great bread. Whoops. And like, don't dump it on the carpet. This is the bread for our... This is the bread for our body. And we have also the bread for our spirit and soul. Mm -hmm. This is the Word of God. That's right. Now this is where the kneading comes in. Oh, this yeah, is feeling really good. This is gonna be good bread. I think I need this. Is a, 
well, a little bit sprinkle. Well, well, maybe sprinkle only. That's good. That's good. It's not going to hurt. <laughs> nope. It's not going to hurt. But we don't want too much either. No, we don't want to Pretty do much, much what we're sprinkling is just to help not to stick it in him, her hand and it make it more faster to knead it. Oh, that feels great. I've been wanting to make tortillas lately. Oh, by the way, speaking of that, I have the I have the flour to okay. make this like you know the Indian bread. Uh huh. I just bought a whole forty pounds of those. Wow. We're gonna try to make it at my house probably. Oh, that's gonna be great. Now what I'm doing is I'm putting a little oh. oil on it. Just on the top. Put just a little. No, I'll put it. I'm gonna coat it real well because we're gonna let it raise. We don't want it sticking to the pan too bad, too badly. There we go. That's good. Oh, this looks wonderful. I'm very happy with the progress so far. Me too. <laughs> very happy with the progress so far. If you guys notice, you don't really speak like a... We live in a hills of yeah. the hilly, <laughs> I mean hillbilly place, but... Okay. That there. She don't speak the no, I was southern born. name because she was an Ohio girl. I was a Yankee. She's a Yankee. I, 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 go I, I, back I, I, where you belong. Yeah, go back, Yankee. Go home, But Yankee. we're in the southern part of the United States, which is Tennessee. But they don't we're say not. go home when they eat my bread. <laughs> they say stay. make more. Here you go. Make She's more. putting it there and set up for how long? So what we are doing It's now, not baking yet. We're just putting it there to rain. That was a little warm. Come on, we're gonna let this raise in the oven. Let this baby. <laughs> we're raise. gonna let it raise till it's double its size. So you can go ahead and for for how long? Till it's double in size. I'll tell it double the size. So yeah. we don't know how long. We'll tell you later. But yeah. anyway, we'll show you later again mm. what the come out 